Hola, welcome to Aida's Kitchen. Bienvenidos. My name is Aida Lugo McAllister and I am going to demonstrate how to prepare two mojitos. The traditional mojito and the passion fruit mojito, mojito de palcha. There are different stories regarding the exact origin of this popular drink. You will read that it was invented by the South American Indians, the English pirate Sir Francis Drake, the African slaves, y ahí sigue la lista. The common denominators that these individuals either lived or arrived in Cuba when a tonic was created for medicinal purposes using some of the ingredients for a mojito. Therefore, the mojito is considered a Cuban cocktail. This is what I can tell you for sure. The mojito is a very refreshing drink, especially during the summer months, like right now. It has a sweet mint lime flavor. When you add a tropical fruit like palcha, then you are giving a fruity taste to the sweet mint lime flavor. I live in the Midwest and I am not able to find fresh passion fruit. But if you go to the Latin market, you will be able to purchase frozen passion fruit pulp. This is the Goja brand, but you purchase the brand of your preference. Just let it thaw in the refrigerator for several days. This is passion fruit pulp when it is thawed. One of the essential ingredients for the mojitos is fresh mint leaves. When I arrived from Puerto Rico this summer in May, I decided to grow some mint plants because I fell in love with the mojitos. Let's go and cut some fresh mint leaves. I will need approximately 24 mint leaves for the mojitos. Before we start preparing the mojitos, I am going to cut a line in half. Each half will be used for one mojito. Cut each half in two quarters. Place in a bowl and continue this process for the other half. We are going to first prepare the traditional mojito. These are the ingredients that you will need. Fresh mint leaves, white sugar, chunks of lime, white rum, club soda or soda water. Club soda is carbonated water with added minerals. Soda water is carbonated water with no additives. And ice. In a tall glass, place six to eight mint leaves at the bottom. Add the chunks of lime and two tablespoons of white sugar or to taste. With a muddler, gently press down and twist to release the lime juice and the essential oils from the mint leaves. want to tear apart the mint leaves. Look how much juice is released from half a lime. Using a bar spoon, 
stir to combine until the sugar is dissolved into the lime juice. This takes approximately one minute. Notice how the sugar is completely dissolved. Fill the glass halfway with ice. And pour two ounces of white rum. Give it a quick stir. Add more ice and fill the glass with club soda or soda water. Stir to combine. Decorate with a sprig of mint and a lime wedge. Serve with a straw. We can now prepare the passion fruit mojito, mojito de palcha. All the ingredients are exactly the same that were used for the traditional mojito except for the tropical fruit. Therefore, some of the beginning steps will be repeated. In a tall glass, place six to eight mint leaves at the bottom. Add the chunks of lime and two tablespoons of white sugar or to taste. With a muddler, gently press down and twist to release the lime juice and the essential oils from the mint leaves. You don't want to tear apart the mint leaves. how much juice is released from half a lime. Using a bar spoon, stir to combine until the sugar is dissolved into the lime juice. This takes approximately one minute. Notice how the sugar is completely dissolved. Fill the glass halfway with ice. And pour two ounces of white rum and three ounces of passion fruit pulp. Give it a quick stir. Add 
more ice. And fill the glass with club soda or soda water. Stir to combine. Decorate with a sprig of mint and a lime wedge. In Puerto Rico, this drink is sometimes served with a cocktail cherry on top. Serve with a straw. We just finished preparing two different mojitos, the traditional mojito and the passion fruit mojito, mojito de palcha. As I mentioned earlier, this is such a refreshing drink to serve your guests, especially during the summer months. Many mojitos are prepared in a homemade syrup. In the future, I will make another mojito cooking video using the homemade syrup. Let's first try the traditional mojito. This is so delicious with a sweet minty lime flavor. Now let's taste the passion fruit mojito. Esta bebida es del otro mundo. This drink is out of this world. If you want a tropical, fruity, flavored mojito, yours truly. I hope you have enjoyed watching my YouTube video on how to prepare traditional mojito and passion fruit mojito, mojito de pacha. Thank you for watching my YouTube cooking video. Please share, like, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you would like a copy of my cookbook, visit my website, idaskitchenboricua.com, and click on the cookbook tab. My cookbook is a bilingual Puerto Rican cookbook, and it contains 42 authentic Puerto Rican recipes that I learned how to cook while living in Puerto Rico. This side is the English version. If you flip the book over, the other side is the Spanish version. Again, thank you for watching my YouTube cooking video.